Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, a beautiful uh, Tuesday morning here in uh, Austin, Texas. Uh, this is day 1050 of the Three Plus Minutes of Planks Challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Uh, thoughts of my mind. It's just a little before 1 a.m. Uh, in the morning. And I haven't been able to go back to sleep uh, since I got back to Austin. Uh, got back to Boston about Austin about 10:30 ish, and uh, actually I've been sitting here watching this movie called uh, Fireproof, and uh, getting a lot of God winks from it. Anyway, uh, thoughts on my mind this morning. Uh, I talked about this a little bit in the last three days. Uh, went with a friend of mine, uh, Ben, to assist him this weekend on some tailgating events. Uh, for his company, Sports Fan Experiment. And I wasn't exactly sure it was something that I personally would have wanted to do, uh, but the idea for me was just to be of service. And so I did it. There were some really amazing moments. Like in the last three days, I've had some of the most incredible moments in just a single little bit, this small fraction of time. Like it's so much that I really can't explain it all. But I'm gonna talk about one particular experiment, uh, experience, and it's the last one. The last interview we did before we left Arlington to make our way to Austin was with a gentleman named Hondo. Hondo was going to the Texas Rangers game versus the Yankees. And uh, it was such an incredible experience for him. You see, he had lost his dad nine years ago. And um, before his dad passed, his dad was supposed to take him to a Yankees Rangers game. But unfortunately, it didn't happen. And so for nine years, Hondo had been waiting to be able to have this moment. But there was work that he needed to get done. He had to work. He had to take and provide, take care of and provide for his family before he got to the space that he was able to do it. But today he went after nine years with his dad watching over him to the game. Now Hondo's a Rangers fan, but his dad's a really big Yankees fan. And even though he was a Rangers fan, he was the only person that we interviewed, at least Ranger fan, that actually wanted the Yankees to win to honor his dad. Unfortunately, the Yankees won eight to four. Rondo's story so touched me because here's the thing, I lost my dad three years ago. And there's something that I do every time I think of him, especially when I think of 1010, which is my dad's birthday. I kiss my lips and I point up to the sky to honor him. And the only, ever per the only other person I've ever, ever seen do the same thing was Hondo today. <laughs> Struck a chord with me. That man was letting out tears, finding it hard to hold it back, I had to keep his sunglasses on. And at the end of the interview, we hugged like brothers. It was such an amazing experience and I'm thankful that I got to witness it. Anyway, that's my thoughts for the day. As always, be blessed today and every day. Thank you for listening. Peace.